you sure about this, Kiki? When have I ever been wrong? Name one time. I don't lie to you, Nick. And without a doubt, this is who we saw. Yeah, that's him. He's there a lot. Take one more look. Definitely him. Yo, Sarge, where does it? That Diaz works for the raid. I heard the rumor. Got something. It's Diaz. Remember, we get Diaz and we get out. What about the girls? We try to set them free. Here, Kiki. Thanks, Nick. Watch yourself. Excuse me, boys. I don't remember. He came in with three other men and five girls. I must have missed him. You saw him. Where did he go? Yeah. Uh, for, for, for floor? Uh, it's to, it's to him. Go. We have 1045B. Come in. There's no signal. Someone's using a jammer, Sarge. It's a setup. They knew you we were coming. What's up, little bitches? You're looking for me? I'm right here. Fast bang.
Heard? No. You? No. Sarge, I'm bleeding out. No, you'll be all right. I get raised. Backup is coming. Come on, you got this. Doctors say you were lucky. Your head was just grazed. The shoulder hits were worse. We need some rehab on that. But it will be fine. You will be fine. Hi, Sophia. Hello. shouldn't be alive. Don't say that, Nick. She's right. You gotta focus on the real bad guys, the ones who's responsible for all this. This wasn't your fault. Lieutenant Kalalo, I need a word. Dr. Minter. I just came from the crime scene. Do you realize what kind of PR nightmare we have on our hands? What the hell happened? It's a bloodbath out there. Almost an entire strike team was wiped out. With all due respect, Captain, this is the violent crime unit. We deal with the worst of the worst. Funny how he made it out. Sergeant Payton is an excellent team leader. Was a team leader. He's through. He led them right into an ambush. His recklessness caused all this. With all due respect, sir, I think you're looking for a scapegoat. Watch yourself, Lieutenant. Somebody didn't do their job right. I'm saying it was him. Keep up this attitude. It could be you, too. What? Excuse me, sir? Is that a threat? Are you threatening me? Stand down, Lieutenant! Are you threatening Lieutenant, me? Lieutenant, stand down! Captain. Captain. It's on me. Just me.
you know, we should probably get out of these chairs at some point. Why would we do that? Hmm, I don't know, get some exercise or something. We came here to relax. Besides, it's a long walk to the bar. <laughs> I like your thinking. <sighs> Yes, please. Another one, what? <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Hi, I am Lieutenant Efren Kalalo. I'm deeply sorry for your loss. Look, I've been here for hours. I've told everyone that interviewed me exactly what I saw. I've read your statement. That must have been a horrific experience for you. We've confirmed that your husband was employed by the FBI back in the States and that you were vacationing here, as you told us. So you believe my account of what happened? Do you know if your husband was involved with the perpetrators in any way? What do you mean? Not counting your husband, we have three dead. All innocent people. We have a lot of gangs here, and when they go to war, they- This wasn't a gang war. I gave an exact description of the people that I saw that were involved. I appreciate that. It's just that there are dozens of conflicting descriptions about the perpetrators and what they look like. I believe this man was in charge. Impressive work. 
I'm a police sketch artist. Do you recognize him? I'm not sure. Can you wait here, please? This is Detective Jovelin Savio from the Violent Crime Unit. Hello, Mrs. Wells. I'm so sorry for your loss. She will take you to a safe place. Stop by my hotel first. Sorry, it's too dangerous. guys? No, but they know you. That's why we can't go back to your hotel. You did good. Okay, show me. What's wrong? Batteries. Huh. Oh, here it goes. That's my wife. Keep watching, Mr. Kamato. Who's that creep with Vivian? His name is David Beckles. He's a car salesman. But it doesn't matter. What do you mean? Keep watching, Mr. Kamato. She has two lovers. Slut. Keep watching, Mr. Gamato. Three lovers? Clients. She's a pro, Mr. Gamato. A prostitute? Call girl. A uh, high class call girl. That's why she kisses on the lips. Not that I know. Never should have married such a young woman. Oh, uh, you know, you, you don't want to watch anymore. You don't, you don't want to see this. It's going to break your heart. Not again. Uh, oh, wow. Ooh.
I'm sorry. Surveillance photos. I'm really sorry I had to find out about your wife this way, Mr. Kamada. Arigato, Mr. Kamato. What was that, Charlie? I forgot the camera was rolling. Did you forget to don't sleep with our clients, too? Technically, she's not a client. Hey, I don't have a hot girlfriend. Wanna see it again? How's it going? It's going good, Nick. I'd like for you to meet Cheryl Wells. Charlie Benz, private investigator. What are we doing here? Lieutenant Kalalo believes that they can help you. And who are they? Nick Payton was a sergeant on the Violent Crime Unit Strike Force, and Charlie Benz was a Los Angeles police officer. All right, Mr. Payton, why aren't you with the Strike Force anymore? The bust and bat, we were set up, and I took the hit for it. Mr. Benz, why aren't you with LAPD? It's complicated. He slept with his commander's wife. I used to have a problem. He's sex addict. I go to meetings now. Look, Mrs. Ooh. Wells, these men are actually really good at what they do. Trust me, they can help you. Help with what? As an FBI agent, my husband worked with Interpol more than once. I'm guessing that he recognized this man from one of his previous cases. He's called the Wraith. Police artist did a sketch for me two years ago. I've dealt with Buster before. You think you can find him? If he's back in this area, yes. But you'll have to be fast, because he moves his base of operations around all the time. Excuse me. The Wraith? The cold-blooded human and drug trafficker that no one ever sees? And if they do, they end up dead? Which is why they call him the Wraith in the first place? That's who we're going after? Yes. Like Javelin just said, he works globally. He's probably not even in the Philippines right now. You lost an entire team and almost got killed. And now it's rumored that he has his own private army. Great. Why the hell can't the police handle this? Because Lieutenant Kalalo believes that some of the force is actually on the Wraith's payroll. That's why Nick got set up when he went after Carlo Diaz. Look, this is Wells. I feel for you. I really do. But we work fraud, cheating partners and some dating scam cases. I'll give you 50,000 US dollars if you find him. We can look for him. Another 50 if you bring him to me. Mommy can't hide forever. Does anyone know what his real name is? No. Wonderful. I can work with this. We should take her somewhere safe. I'll take her to my place. The lieutenant says that this is off the books. Call him on his mobile phone only after you find the wraith. And Nick, don't forget that you still have friends. Where do you want to begin? We check every source we have. Somebody has to know something. No trouble getting them to talk. Well, we'll make them talk. We'll make them talk? Mm -hmm. You gonna go all Godzilla on me? Godzilla. Every time you take a case personal, someone gets their head pounded in. Not all the time. Most of the time. Some of the time. 
Pretty much every time. So what? When you were a cop, you didn't get passionate about your cases? When I was a cop? Yeah. Work was work. I did my job. I didn't take things personal. That's what we're gonna do on this job. We're private investigators, not terminators. If you want out. I don't want out. We're partners. And you want your cut of the money? That too. <laughs> for this guy. No, I haven't seen him. You're sure? Yeah, I'm sure. Okay. We are getting nowhere fast. Nobody's saying a thing. What are they holding out? Probably scared of the Russian Hulk. We should have done this my way. Mm. And we would have ended up in jail. Look, Nick, I know how much this thing means to you. No, you don't. I got my old team killed by this son of a bitch. I owe him. We'll get him, partner. Something will turn up. Sorry. We're oh, cool. Hey, Nick. Charlie. Hey. Hi, Zoya. How are you, folks? Good. This is great. Lots of deliveries. Listen, you're right all over the city. Have you seen him? Hmm. Who's he? Someone very bad. We really need to find him. I can keep my eyes open. Why don't you ask Kiki for help? She's good at this stuff. She's away. In rehab. No, she's not. I saw her at Club Dread last night. And I saw her with that Datu guy outside the Tiki Lounge. That's the first place we checked. Told you. We should have done this my way. Do you always have to have the last word? Absolutely. <laughs> what else do you have? Information. I don't know about that guy. Where can I find Dato? Who's that? Whoa, 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 whoa. No more lie. I don't know anything, Dato. I don't know. I don't know. I don't speak Wookiee, Chewbacca. 
Talk. Really, really, I don't know. After. 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 Thank you. Very man. Hold it, five ball. Relax. Well, well, well. Look at you. What are you here for? You're no longer a cop. That's true. But I missed you so much, Dad, that I thought I'd stop by. What do you want, Peyton? First, where is Kiki? She's smoking coal. Mm. Somewhere. I see. You're still pissed you can't have Kiki, right? I don't know what you're talking about, Peyton. But I've been banging Kiki like a firecracker. You know, Belle, you should probably leave. The pin boyfriend over here is going down. Now. It's time someone shut your mouth for you. Second question. Who is he? I don't know. I don't know him. Look again.
I thought you were in rehab. It sucked. I had to leave. Have you moved out of your place? My landlord wants favors again. Who's this? The Wraith. Seriously? Yeah. I've never seen his face before. But I heard a lot about him, though. This man, because of Spain. Me and Charlie are working for a woman now. He killed her husband and called blood right in front of her. Hello. Hi. Mm. Hi, I'm Sophia, and you must be... That's Kiki, our informant. Hmm, cool. So this is the girlfriend. <laughs> I guess so. You want some Chinese? Yes, Chinese is very good. We met in New York. I was a cop and she was a journalist. I still am. But back then, when I got transferred to the Philippines, Nick said he wouldn't let me fly alone. I followed you to Manila. Finally got a job at VCU. Rest is history. What can I say? That's a really nice love story. Thank you. Anyway, I just stopped by to remind you of our date on Friday. Theater. Don't you forget. Okay? I will not. Thank you. Bye, Kiki. Say hi to Charlie for me, right? I will. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Brought your Chinese food. Sophia stopped by. She said hello. There is one thing, though. I don't know if it's going to mean much, but I worked at Reza's bar yesterday. Oh, great go go is there. Which I've heard. Anyway, there was this guy, this big guy, and he had long blonde hair. Long blonde hair? Yeah, and, um,. His name was Dorn. He likes the girls at Reese's Bar. He's from out of town, so he doesn't come around often. But yesterday, I saw him there. The last time I saw him was two years ago, when you were trying to take down Carlo Diaz. What time have you seen him yesterday? Around happy hour. Great time to go. Appetizer are half off. OK. You can stay here tonight. You can have a couch over there and kick it. Take it. Take it. But tomorrow, you start to earn it. You can clean up around here. You can answer the phone. And there's a secretary desk. We should start to use it. We have a secretary's desk? There's a secretary desk. Looks like you got my whole day planned out for me. Get used to it. Sex Addict Anonymous meetings. Oh, good. Okay, I guess. It's, you know, addiction control is difficult with so many enablers out there. Enablers? Cute Filipino girls. I mean, they're beyond cute. And given what I'm up against, I'd say that my self discipline is pretty impressive. You're my hero, Charlie. Yeah, I know. Hey, it's him. We can't jack him up too much. We need him to talk. Don't worry.
Two years ago. Looks like you got lucky. Hey, you're coming with us now. <laughs> Why? We need to talk. What are you? Cops? No. Got booted out, huh? <laughs> well, I tell you what, I'm leaving now. And if you're smart, that's a big if. You forget that we ever met. I know what you want to talk about. It's not gonna happen. You either shoot me, or get the fuck out of my way. Yeah. Or, we're gonna go mano a mano, and you can try to make me talk. But I don't think your balls are big enough. Nick, what are you doing? Put your gun away, Charlie. Big guys. Are you police? Private investigator. Whoa, so you're chasing bad guys? Yeah, really bad guys. See which way they went? Um, they went through that gate. But I can show you the better way. Take it. Oh. Charlie. I'm an exchange student, you know. That's great. I run track in school. I don't doubt that. Is this a big case? Pretty big. I'm thinking of being an Olympic athlete. I believe you. Come on. 
Oh. I had this guy. They thought they'd have him, buddy. Oh. Wow. You guys put some pain on him. Although, you might want to bulk up a bit. Get a little more mess. I should get a pic of this. Oh, no, 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 no photos. Oh. Super undercover. Oh, cool. Thank you. But you should go. And good luck at the Olympics. Thank you. I'm going to be watching for you. Olympics? What? So you like go-go girls, right? Hey, 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 hey. You're about to lose your balls, man. We're gonna ask you some questions, and you will answer them. Leave it. I've seen him do it. Holy crap! Is he dead? Nope. Just out. He was giving us trouble when we were tying him up. Well, can you blame him? Okay, so now that I've seen that, does that make me an accomplice? Pretty much. To what? Kidnapping, discharging a firearm in public. Property damage, lots of it. Yeah, that too. And the other stuff. I thought you guys only did, like, cheating spouses, dating fraud, stuff like that. So did I. <laughs> it was like when you were a cop. Actually, worse. You know, Kiki, it's important that Dorn will stay in the trunk by now. If anyone stop by looking for him or for us, be polite, be professional. And lie. You never heard of Dorn? Tell him we're on an infidelity case. What if the cops come by? Lie again. Tell them nothing. They could work for Edric Paul. Who's that? The Wraith. Or at least as Dorn said. So I'm working for you now? Yeah, that's the plan. If you want. OK. But I want to raise. I didn't offer you a salary yet. Yeah, but when you do, it's gonna be too low. You hired her. We gotta go. Yeah. A race. A race. Give me a minute. She's a good woman. I know you. Something big is happening. Please, tell me what's going on. I told you it's nothing. I care about you. Don't shut me out. OK, I have to do something. Part business, part personal. How dangerous is it? Don't you dare miss the theater night on Friday. I won't. I promise. Don't worry. Dorn level with us? I think he wanted to keep his balls. I just hope I can read his handwriting. Nick. Lieutenant, I think I found the raid. I need some help. Where are you? I'll give you my location. But listen, I need my friends. Tell me you're still a low-life gun shoe. Surprise me, Fort. I thought it'd be beach pressure by now. Barking orders to meet their mates. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know the three stooges, right? 
Yeah. I've seen a few of their films. I see you're still getting your butt kicked. And I see you still nagging me when I do hands. Good to see you. Oh, good to see you, too. It's been a while, Peyton. Too long, my friend. Здорово, Колян. Витя. А это кто? Модель, гид, учитель танцев. А? <laughs> Guys, this is Charlie. He's my friend. You can count on him. Charlie, Haynes, Ford, Dylan, and Victor. Great to meet you all. Another Russian, huh? Yeah. There is more than one in the world. I was talking about speaking Russian. It's called bilingual. You know what it's called when you speak only one language. What? American. <laughs> They're just busting your balls, pal. We do it all the time. No. You see, we all used to work together with Nick. Understood. I work with him now. All right, let's get this out of the way. We all know you got set up by the brass holes in PR, Nick. Everybody knew it was bullshit. Absolutely. Enough of this. Let's kick some ass. I see you came hot. Well, we sexed up the best we could. And I brought a few things that go boom. Not bad. I can slice the balls off a mosquito with this. That wasn't creepy. You gotta see this. Dorn told the truth. They're getting ready to move. Figures. He's always on the move. Can we get eyes on him? Check out the tent. It's all big fall. Mm -hmm. That's the son of the bitch. You know what, Charlie? Screw the money. Oh. You do that, and they'll know exactly where we're at. We can still get them.
I can take out the ops. At least. They won't be able to tell the others where we're coming from. What about the 50? Who was the quickest runner? Me. Me. Think you can take to one of the 50s? I can make it to the first one, but I'm going to need a lot of cover. Would a diversion help? Yeah, a lot. You see the ground snipers? That would be the biggest problem. And again, I don't know how many of them. You could end up stepping on that. Call the lieutenant. Get the rest of the forces back up. Yeah. And the moment we do that, there's a good chance he'll get tipped off. They'll be gone. If we want to get him, we're going to have to do this on our own. But it's up to you. Let's do it. I can make it down that ridge. Pick up the ride. That'll be your diversion. Good enough. Victor, where can you get your best shot? Right there. Charlie Ford and me will take this side and try to get to the tent to grab a call. Hey, Victor, give us tent before we get to the position. And after that, take out the OPs. And Heinz, as soon as we get to one of the 50s, take it. We'll need that far power. You got it. One question. If we get this call, asshole, what do we do with him? Take him alive. Me and Charlie are supposed to bring him to Mrs. Wells. For what? We didn't ask. not find Dorn. Go!
I wish I could offer you a cigar, but I ain't my way. You come in advice. I'd rather not. I blow up my lab, you kill all my men. Wouldn't be hard to believe that I fought back and got away. Not this time. You know I got international friends in low places. I wouldn't be happy if I was arrested. We're not here to arrest you. As I said, you're coming with us. Как нога? Спасибо, Кварь. Ничего. Good job. Well, take a good look. Come on, take it. Колян, ну когда же мы с тобой увидимся? Чтоб без стрельбы девчонок своих возьмем. Посидим, а? Спасибо тебе за все, Витя. Будешь в Маниле звони, лечи ногу. You okay? Cold. Cool. It's so cold in Russia. I used to have a nice fishing shack in my bathtub with my bear. Oh. <laughs> I said hit it. Let's go. I'll be right back. Okay. That's with Anya. Next time you want to take down some bad guys, count me in. I promise, Dylan. Thanks for everything. Next time you need your handheld, make sure you give me a call. I'm a speed dial. I'll be right back. Hey. Hey. You did good out there. Thanks. I was wondering, uh, would you like to go out with me sometime? I'll go out with you. But if you cheat on me, I'll kill you. Call me. If you ever get tired of working with you, you can be PI with us. <laughs> Are you kidding me? That's too boring. <laughs> the lieutenant has a doctor that will take care of Victor. No questions asked. Good. What are you going to do with Cole? I don't know. It's up to Mrs. Wells. He doesn't go to jail. Let us know if you need a cleaner. I will. Thank you. Bye. Right. Good 
never have worked out between her and I. Send them in. Hey, Kiki. You can go home now. I'll see you tomorrow. But, but, but I thought no. that... No. No. Just lock the front door on your way out. Do it. This is Aldra Cole, the Wraith, and Dorn, his... Viking. You yeah, see, nice social club. Can we get on with this? Shut up. You murdered my husband, Matthew. He didn't stand a chance considering the odds against him. Matthew was a good man. A good husband. And an expert marksman. He taught me all about guns. I shoot them. Man, that's so touching. Are you done? No. Am I under arrest? No. Detective Sabio, I, I need a car to the airport. I'm transporting my husband's body back home. Okay, Mrs. Phillips. Your money will be in your accounts before the end of the day tomorrow. Is that all right? Yeah. Mr. Payton, Mr. Benz, thank you. Say, Lieutenant, we need cleaners. Done. What are we going to do now? We'll sit down and wait for cleaners. Little fall, little pain, but I'm not scared. It 
was wrong to believe that we can stay Stay together safely Should have known from the start that I was blind Thought I did all my best to make things right Now I'm lost like the moon in the sunlight of the day Can go on without you If we met Petrified, paralyzed, I lost my mind If you gave me a sign, then I could find How to get you closer 